Are you bored of your Windows screen and want to have something cool like this? Or you want to look like a badass hacker? Then no worries, in this video I will show you how you can make your Windows screen from this to this. Before that, don't forget to hit the YouTube button by liking the video and subscribing to the channel. Let's go. Open your favorite browser and search for index UI. Click on the, this first link that appears. It's a GitHub repository. Get squared. Uh, come down to the downloads part or uh, here the Q and A and click on the releases so from this list you can download uh, the application according to your uh, uh, operating system for me it's windows 64 bit so i'm gonna download this one you should wait a little bit for this to download it's about 67 megabytes and it depends on your internet speed how long it will take but for me just maybe less than a minute or so so once the download completes, open it. Uh, once you want, you can choose uh, anyone who is on your system can access to this or just you. For me, I'm the only user, so I'll click only for me. Click next here, install, and that's it. You have just downloaded and installed the edX edX user interface so no i know i'm not gonna run it finish and let me close the browser and you can just click on the application icon here on your screen double click it and it will open Now from here, you can just do whatever you want. It's completely, you have the complete control of your system just in a different way. You can also change the themes from here. For example, let's say Matrix. And it will completely change. That's it uh, for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. So you can just follow the links that, that are in the description, download it, install it, and explore it yourself. Um, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and also hit that notification bell to be notified when I upload a new video. Uh, see you in the next sorry video. Oh, come on, really, right? And as you can see, there's nothing to do with that because that's not a command. Uh, you can just easily exit it with typing exit and closing it.